everybody welcome back to our channel and our family vlog the continuation of our adventure so we're going hiking today and to other villages yeah we're going to do to do hiking and see the villages and uh, the simple life in the village see you around we right now we are going for hiking in the nearby village Join us as we go. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm I'm not. 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 Pare, am not. I'm 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 not. It's a little bit down of uh, like uh, we will say from Baguio City. This is Pangasinan area. Parang ganun po. Kasi yung Katmandu na sa ano siya? Na sa mataas ng part. Malamig doon. Dito yung init is just like Philippines. Parang pinas lang. Tingnan nyo po yung ambience. Yung paligid. Yung uh, mga taniman ng uh, pero nagtatanim sila dito ng sa Katmandu yung ano ba yan tawag uh, wheat rice yeah ito nagtatanim sila dito ng parang sa Pilipinas lang sa atin malala kong sa probinsya namin so kita kits again later banda banda oh yeah banda mm. si Baba tinuturo niya yung banda Banda means yung cabbage. Kanin niya man cabbage. Ayun po. Sabi ng baby ko, Mommy, this towel is heavy. Can we change? So, kasi nakalimutan niya magdala ng cup. Niya, ng cup niya. Sombrero. Kaya, kinuha niya yung towel. <laughs> kasi mainit. Umalis kasi kami mainit na. Kaya, nag-change kami. Looking, uh, what's this? Walking in the road wearing this towel. <laughs> it's a nice adventure. Hey, hey guys. The uh, baga yung sa atin pag nag palay. Actually, they gather just, just to feed their cows and then buffalo because that's one of their income, the source of income of the Nepal, Nepali people here. Yung, uh, kasi yung cow. Uh, at saka yung buffalo, they get the milk. And then, fresh milk po yung uso dito. Walang, walang fresh, walang milk in in the bags or milk powder is very expensive. So, we are, we used to put the fresh milk in our coffee and then in the tea. So, they gather this uh, before winter time. After the harvest, they stack up this thing to, so they have enough food for the, uh, their cows and buffalo. Similar to Philippines in Did some villages, you know, uh, the typical villages in the Philippines also they have this kind of uh, hills around also, and uh, but here their was that their land area for planting it's kind of limited. Unlike in Philippines, <laughs> it's a vast, uh, wide, wide. Yeah, but here it's kind of uh, limited here because, because of, of the hills. Most, most of the area are hilly. Yeah, but uh, it's nice here. You know, uh, life here is very simple. You can see uh, with the houses of the people here and also very peaceful. That's one thing I like here. You want to live here? Well, not really. <laughs> Not Sorry, really. but not really. Yeah. <laughs> Buddy, thank you for watching our family vlogs. And please keep tuning in. Bye. <laughs> thank you for joining us. It's not cow, it's a buffalo, I think. Mommy. Yes? A buffalo is so cute. It's so cute. He's so cute. The, the buffalo. No, the other one is a baby. Look at the baby down there. Ah, uh, Over there. This is the mommy, I think, and then the baby there. No, mommy, this is the daddy. brother, mommy, daddy, brother. No, this is the daddy. Oh, the mommy, the brother. Yeah, this, this one is mommy, mommy. baby. This, this is the, the mommy. Where? Which one? Which one is? Don't get closer. 
Mommy, that is the mommy. Okay. How about the daddy? Yeah. And then in the middle. And the baby? Yeah. Okay, let's go now. This uh, tree, I think they call it pipa. Pipa tree. They said that uh, this is around more than 100 years. This is a tree. Yeah, they said, they said that this is more than 100 years. Amazing tree. A big one. Yeah, that's really a big one. Two of them. And it's really refreshing to be here under the tree. Pahinga muna. Step on the cabbage, okay? Cabbage. Go in the middle. Cabbage. Go there in the middle. Can you go there? Can you go down? Baby, can you go down? Okay. Can you go down? Go there. Okay, so this is the cabbage okay. plantation. Okay, no. <laughs> what are you What are you making there? Volcano. Volcano. Wow, you're a smart boy. Yes, it is. There's a volcano down there. And what else you're making? A hills? Yes? GP. <laughs> what a smart boy. And we'll go here with the... BJ, BJ, can you explain to them what are you making there? Uh, I'm making. What is that? Well, I was just like there is a wall surrounded. This is uh, surrounded by the wall, wall of sand. This is a pool. Oh, it's a swimming pool. Oh, that's a good idea. Do you think it will? It, the water will. It, the water it will be. Absorb in the sun. <laughs> yes. Water and sand makes what? You know. You know. They don't know. It makes what? It makes cement. Cement. How did you know that? The sand and the water it will make cement. Yeah. Oh, I don't think so. Can. Why? We can swim. What happened? Why we can no, swim? No, we can swim. We have to go back home. Oh! <laughs> Did you drop it somewhere? Why? Because they said we can clean tomorrow. Oh, they not... have to clean. They have many things to do tomorrow. Today? I mean, today, yeah. Today. So, we can add? Okay, you can enjoy here. You can make a... I want to... I'm also GP! Why are you all trying to fill it up with sand? Huh? It's a rocket. <laughs> you're making a rocket? Yep. You're making a volcano down there and now you're making a rocket. Do you think it will fly? No, I'm going uh, like that. <laughs> how, how, how it will fly? Twink. Twink? <laughs> and it bounce. Say hi. Good morning everybody! Welcome to the Riverside! Kamusta po sa inyo lahat mga kababayan? Hi nanay! I'm here in different place outside Kathmandu city. This is two hours from the place where we are staying. And it's very nice to be outside the city uh, sometimes. Yeah. We do it like actually once a year. So enjoy nyo po yung beautiful natures in this country. There's so much beautiful places in this country but you have to travel. So our kids will be going back to school on Monday. So this is the last uh, adventure, family adventure before the kids will be uh, busy going to school. So. There's a saying that about the river, uh, it says, one philosopher says that a river never passes at the same place twice. I don't know what it means. What does it mean? I don't know. But I just want to challenge you again about the river. Yeah. 
you want the blessing guys in your life to be like flowing like a river look at the river how beautiful it is yeah according to my own experiences or my personal experience we really enjoy the blessing of God why so the secret is if you want the blessing to flow in your life like a river like this it continues flowing just give to others think about others give to needy people for sure 100 percent as distant and proven guys the blessing will flow in your life are you agree so if you want if you want to experience that look at that the blessing will flow in your life like a river give to others thank you so much so we have to or i mean we are preparing to go back to the city and then uh, this is the last vlog in this place <laughs> we stay here overnight and it's really very affordable mga kasisi pag pumunta kayo dito we will bring you here you will enjoy the nature ako personally i'm the i'm a like nature's lover i'm not really fan of uh, buildings or uh, what is this the modern modern uh, modern things i love nature so i really uh, enjoy and really appreciate the wonderful creations of god in this country so kailangan na namin mag prepare at ba babalik at uh, my work again <coughs> so bali yeah. tingnan nyo muna yung at last glance kasi maybe hindi na kami makabalik dito sa place na ito kaya it's just making memories in this place that oh one day we went in that place this is famous actually for rafting yeah you see this river this is uh, very good for rafting and then uh, they are asking us to experience the rafting but uh, I don't know how to swim and I have a uh, babies with me so I don't like to take a, to take a chance <laughs> so scary <laughs> because according to them this river is a three-story uh, building deep would you imagine how how deep is this river so they use this river last night there's a lot of people that doing the in evening time they're doing the rafting this place and I felt so scary <laughs> I feel so scared, I mean. So, I uh, It's not that expensive, it's really affordable, but I don't want to. I don't, <laughs> I don't want to experience it. I just enjoy watching them doing, doing the rafting, shouting. But there is an expert guy that will be with you in the boat. But maybe if the voice, our voice will be a little bit uh, bigger. If uh, we, God's willing, we can come back here someday. Why not, right? Yeah. So, hanggang dito na lang muna yung aming uh, pag-share ng adventure sa inyo guys. Kasi, I cannot uh, take vlog in, on the way back home or even when coming here because person, um, if I go travel, if I do the, uh, what is this? Um, if I'm in the bus, I'm getting dizzy and I cannot even uh, look on the phone. So, I cannot show some vlog on the way and on coming here I just sleep and sit down yeah so thank you so much for watching and for uh, joining our family adventure in this country so we're happy to share it with you guys so I will see you again to the next vlog to the next family vlog you take care everybody stay safe stay strong and stay blessed. Bye!